Welcome back to Code Wars. We are in the JavaScript implementation of the challenge Welcome. And it tells us your startup's business analyst has told marketing that your website has a large audience in Scandinavia and surrounding countries. Marketing thinks it would be great to welcome visitors to the site in their own language. Luckily, you already use an API that detects the user's location, so this is an easy win. The task. Think of a way to store the languages as a database, an object. The languages are listed below so you can copy and paste. Write a welcome function that takes a parameter language, always a string, and returns a greeting if you have it in your database. It should default to English if the language is not in the database or in the event of an invalid input. So this is the database they've provided. We just want to go ahead and copy this. And in here, we're going to say var database. And we're going to assign to it our database and then end it. So now we have access to this database. We can go ahead and iterate through the database and look for whether or not whatever is passed in is language is inside here. And if so, we want to print that welcome in that language. So we can do this with a for in and we can basically do for, then we can say var, and we can name this next one whatever. We can do key in database, because that's where we want to look through. We're going to do an if, and we're going to say if key is equal to language that is passed in, then we would want to return database key. So let's uh, see what this does, run sample test. So we are passing two tests. Here we're getting undefined. And I think, let's go back here. So it should default to English if the language is not in the database. So that would be our else, which we would want to actually probably do outside of Our, uh, for in that way once this is done and it doesn't find then it would return it and we want to go ahead and return database with English key so now this actually should work according to the instructions here so let's run and we see our tests are passing. And let's go ahead and try to submit this. And all our tests are passing. So real quick, all we did is uh, paste in their, their uh, object they gave us that basically has keys that are languages. And then the values are how to say welcome in that language. So once we have that, we just use this for in. We specify our count as key, which is the current key in each iteration. So we say uh, var key in database, so inside of here, if whatever key we're currently at equals the language that is passed in, then we will return that database key. So we'll return the value of that key. Um, if it is not in this list or it's invalid, then once this goes through every uh, instant and it comes false then we come out of there and then we just return the default of English which we'll just say welcome in English and that is it for this challenge hope you guys enjoyed it see you on the next one